guys, welcome to Martin Made. My name is Stephanie and today I'm making birthday cards. So Pinterest is the best place for ideas, whether they're good or whether they're bad. So many times I try out things on Pinterest and they turn out great and other times I try things out and they turn out terrible. Well today I am trying out a Pinterest idea and it's a birthday card that I am making and so I'm going to give it a try and see how it goes. So let's get started. So you're going to take the desired piece of paper that you want to make a card out of and you are going to cut it to 12 inches by five and a half inches and then you are going to mark the edges, the long edges of the card at two inches, four inches, eight inches, and 10 inches. Once you have it marked, you're going to score it at the two inch mark, the four inch mark, the eight inch mark, and the 10 inch mark. Then you are going to go ahead and start um, making the openings that are like accordions or like a book that opens in the middle. Once you have it folded, then you're going to measure two and three quarter inches down the side of the card, and you are going to put a little mark there, and then you are going to cut that corner off. Once you have both corners cut off, you're going to take double-sided tape and you're going to put on the back of each corner. And then you are going to attach each of the corners that you cut off to the bottom of the card. So what I like to do to even out the card is to take my cutter and just cut along the bottom and the top so that it's nice and even. Next step is to cut a piece of white paper that is five and a quarter by three and three quarter inches. Next, I take photo corners and I will put one corner on each corner of this piece of paper and then I will lay it down on the inside of the card. Now for the last step, and that's to add the greeting. I take a stamp and put it onto a piece of paper, and then I take a fancy little cutter, and I cut out that greeting and then I hot glue it to one side of the card and then attach it. And there you have a card. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. For those of you who are new to this channel, you can hit that red subscribe button down below. 
And for those who would like to comment, you can leave a comment down in the comment section down below and you can let me know um, what are some of the Pinterest ideas that you have tried. And I can't wait to see you guys in the next video and I will see you then. Bye.